My today's speech is about Assyrian language. Painting was the language of communication amongst people few thousand years ago. We still have tablets and scriptures of ancient civilization written with languages that have gone through various changes to become what is being written or spoken today. My ancestors' language is one of the oldest languages in the world history, which goes back to about over 6,700 years old. The language that was used is known as Akkadian Old Aramaic language, which is also known today as a New Aramaic or Assyrian language. As I mentioned, my ancestors' language is part of Akkadian or Old Aramaic language, which by itself is a branch of Semitic language. Akkadian language was itself adopted from Sumerians and became a native language of Assyrians. According to the website Encyclopedia in 1996, different dialects have developed from ancient Aramaic, a language used within the Assyrian Empire. Akkadian language was written in cuneiform from right to left, which contained of 600 or more sign of cuneiform. As Mr. William Varda, an Assyrian author and journalist, stated in the article Assyrian language, past and present. Akkadians and Sumerians together developed an old Aramaic language and transformed the next Assyrian or Babylonian generation. The Aramaic language later in the history was said as an official language by Assyrian Empire and Assyrian people in different parts of Mesopotamia unified to use Aramaic language rather than Akkadian. Aramaic became official language of Assyrian people. Later in history, Aramaic replaced the Hebrew even in Israel. When Aramaic language was replaced with the Akkadian, the alphabet reduced from 600 signs into 22 alphabets. Of course, these 22 letters were much easier to learn and understand. The reason for changing Akkadian to Aramaic was because many of those signs were not well defined or clear to speak. Even though Aramaic language replaced the Akkadian language, Akkadian language was still used on cuneiform written on the tablets, and Aramaic alphabet was written on the papyrus. Syriac is another name of Assyrian alphabet which is under New Aramaic language categories. New Aramaic is written from right to left. All the vocabulary contains of those 22 alphabets. Pronunciation of certain words dialect among Assyrians might be different due to influence of other nations exchanging the culture as well as language over time. The article remarks on the historical backgrounds of the modern Assyrian language written by Geoffrey Khan from the University of Cambridge in 2004 says, even numerous dialects are differ from one area to another or indeed from one village to another. Assyrian or neo aramaic language is one of the ancient languages in the world that has transformed from my ancient Sumerians ancestor to Babylonians. Even though the Assyrian Empire fell apart 2600 years ago, the language is still alive. Many Assyrians around the world know and are able to read and speak in their ancient language. My nation duty is to teach our next generation to read and speak this language, which is very close to extinct. Here I have a picture of Assyrian alphabet, which is starting from here. I can read them for you. This is Alap, Beat, Gemel, Dalat, He, Wav, Zen, Chet, Tet, Yud, Kap, Lamed, Mim, Nun, Simkat, 
ا ه ه ص ا د ق ر ش ش ي ن ت ا And here is the flag of Assyrians.